What's going on, all my fellow mobile developer students? Uh, my name is Robert Smith, and I am currently in PMA3 in statistics. And uh, this is my message in a bottle video, pretty much given. If I could give myself some advice uh, four to eight months ago, what would that advice be? And uh, I think the first thing I would uh, tell myself is to uh, get to know all my classmates. Uh, join the Facebook group. Uh, there's a lot of support there for uh, problems and questions that you'll have. And um, lynda.com is awesome. Uh, I mean, the fact that your uh, subscription is paid for with your tuition is uh, just, you have, you, there's no excuse not to use it. Anything we go over in the classes is covered on Lynda. And uh, it's just, it's an awesome site. You have to go. If you haven't tried it, you uh, really need to uh, go there. Um, as far as managing your time, I would say um, do not, especially once you get to SDI, do not um, put things off until the last couple days or the last day, because uh, you just you you won't have enough time. You need to. Uh, what I started doing in the second week of SDI, and it, it's complicated because of work, but m most of the time I will try to go through the videos uh, over the weekend and then slowly try to start my uh, my coding uh, on Monday, and then I you, deadlines are usually Thursdays, and then uh, um, you should be getting, you know, just putting the finishing touches on it by Thursday. So, just don't wait until the middle of the week to start your projects, because you won't have enough time. And, um, uh, I mentioned lynda.com, um, oh, uh, an awesome tip, um, and this goes for all of your classes, whether you're about to start SDI, or whether you're about to start, like, design, um, the videos that are provided in the weekly activities go into the video link and then when you see the uh, the box with the actual videos in it in the activity uh, right click on the link of the video and uh, save it to uh, like a folder on your desktop or some folder somewhere in finder that way uh, in later classes like you know save all your javascript videos from SDI into a folder uh, labeled JavaScript or SDI and put it on your desktop. That way when you get into visual frameworks and you get into uh, MIU or I wish I would have done it way back in uh, you know MMD1 and MMD2 because uh, those Photoshop and Illustrator tutorials what they are um, would come in handy in like MIU last month. Instead I had to go through and uh, you know I had to go through Linda but um, which isn't bad but it's, it just make it a lot easier if you saved all your videos from all your classes and put them in corresponding uh, folders on your desktop. That way uh, you always have access to them very easily. And uh, that's probably the best tip I can give you. It's, uh, except for Linda. Go to lynda.com if you haven't been to lynda.com. Seriously. Okay. So uh, that's it. And uh, Godspeed to all of you. And... Uh, just uh, don't be nervous. It's not that bad.